purpose of this video is to show you how to access data from last year for your current students on Linkit. So the first thing that you are going to do is log into Linkit using your username and password, or you can sign in through Google. Once you log in, you're going to go to the reporting tab and select your dashboard. In your dashboard, you are going to have a series of different options, but this green select data button is um, the feature that you're always going to use when you're looking at historical data for your students. So you're going to select data. And for now, most of you are wanting to see data from last year, 21-22. So I'm going to leave that checked off and apply that filter. I'm going to make sure that I'm looking at the grade level that I'm interested in seeing. And this is actually the tricky part. I want to see the grade level that the students were in when they took this assessment last year. So for example, current third grade students were second grade students when they took these assessments last year. So I have to select the grade level that the students were in last year in order to see their data from last year. Um, and then I can select whichever assessment I'm interested in seeing. I can select, um, just gonna pull up a star assessment. And I can view that star assessment by clicking on this student result feature, or I can click on several different assessments. I want to see them all lined up together. And if I click on several of them, then I'm going to use the button on the top of the page for student results. When I click on that, I can then see a list of my current students, and I can also see last year's data that is attached to them. So that could include their reading level because that's the assessment I selected, their word study, or their spring ELA assessment. So that is how you find past data on current students. Again, the trick is that first you have to select last school year, and then you have to select grade your students were in last school year in order to see that past data. Okay, I hope that helps.